May the 13th, 2024. Guys, a couple of things I want to talk about in this video. One is what you're looking at here. We've got tornado warnings, severe thunderstorm warnings, marine warnings, flood warnings down in Louisiana and in East Texas. We had the same thing last night, guys, and it was very intense lightning here in central Mississippi. All of this is headed back our way. Now, right here in central Louisiana, we do have a tornado warning. Let's take a look at that. But, guys, I've got information about why the lightning is so intense in the last few days. You, and you probably have guessed it. Scientists have proven that these extreme solar storms and high solar wind speeds cause in, uh, the lightning to intensify on our planet. It, it makes sense. You supercharge the atmosphere. It's got to discharge, and when it does, it discharges hard. And, guys, there was one that hit so close to our house last night, it sounded like it hit it. I expected the power to go off, but it didn't. And that went on for a moment. It was intense. But same thing happening tonight. It looks like a repeat. Here Again, we're here in Louisiana, coming out of Texas, and it's all going to move into Mississippi. And you've got marine warnings off the coast of Florida. Look at this in the panhandle right here. All of this is going to repeat. Again, these I've always said space weather controls Earth's weather. First, we want to look at this tornado warning. Now, this is a close-up of the area, guys. Here's Lafayette. Here's New Iberia right there. Lafayette is where it looks like the tornado has just passed the city proper. I mean, just on the edge, moving east. Look at this. So you, if you're in the Lafayette area, this looks like I-10 uh, going through here. It's right on the I-10, and it's moving east. Let's see what they're saying about it. You can see right now it is over Bow Bridge. I want to show you this quickly before we go to that. Bow Bridge, you're under the gun. Uh, you're south of Baton Rouge, New Iberias here, Franklin. So if you're in the Bow Bridge area, take shelter immediately. And all of this is moving east, slightly northeast from where you're at now. The National Weather Service in Lake Charles has issued a tornado warning for northwestern St. Martin Parish in south central Louisiana. This is until 645. That's only about 10 or 11 minutes from the, it's 634 as I'm reading this. At 630 p.m. CDT, a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located near Atchafalaya uh, Welcome Center or eight miles north of Catahoula, moving east at 60 miles per hour. It says radar indicated rotation. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This dangerous storm will be near Atchafalaya National Wildlife Refuge around 6.35 p.m. Central. That's right now. Take cover now. Moving in, Move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you're outdoors in a mobile home or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Guys, the storm is there now, but all of this is moving east. If you got friends or family in that area, make sure you contact them and make sure they're okay. Hunker down, and uh, let's take a look at why this is intensified. It continues. It says that the activity on the sun is sparking lightning strikes here on Earth. Scientists have found that when gusts of high-speed solar particles enter our atmosphere, the number of the lightning bolts increases. I would say, from what I saw last night in reports from around the nation since the solar storm started, it's not just the number, but the intensity. Because solar activity is closely monitored by satellites, it may now be possible to forecast when these storms will hit. Now, this is an older article. And the uh, research has uh, grown quite a bit since then, but even then it said there's something like 24,000 people struck by lightning each year. So having any understanding or advanced warning of the severity of the lightning storms has to be useful. That's why I'm doing the video. In other words, now that you're seeing these storms pile up and it's supposed to be kind of a rough year for hurricanes and everything else, if they occur during these solar storms, 
expect the lightning to be more intense. Lightning is so dangerous, guys. And like I said last night, something popped right outside the house, and I could not believe it did not knock the breakers out and everything else. It, but it didn't. But this is something to pay attention to. It's science, and with the solar activity increasing, we know things are changing. Lightning will be one of the effects. We're watching you guys in Louisiana watch that tornado and all my friends in Mississippi. It's coming this way. It's a heads up. Be safe.